Hey guys, I'm Avil back again with another video. This time let's talk about this new feature that Nokia 8.1 and some of the other stock Android devices have received. Yes, this is Google Assistant's ambient mode or ambient display feature. So in this video, we'll be talking about this and how you should get it and uh, what are the features that we can experience on it. So before we start, if you're new to my channel, then do hit the subscribe button to watch more videos on stock Android devices and stock Android tips and tricks. And those who have already subscribed, a big thank you to all of you guys. So let's get started. First of all, how you can check that whether you have received it or not, right? First thing that you should do, first of all, you should update your Google app, okay, Google and this one okay here you can see that no update is available for me but if you see that it is showing that you should update so simply update There's the app okay update that app google assistant is really fast these days okay accidentally also it speaks and asks questions sometimes it is irritating what do you say now let's get back to the point now what do you have to do simply settings okay Simply scroll down Google and then account services then go to this option search assistant Google assistant then assistant then scroll down and phone okay so here you should be able to see this option ambient mode now if you can't see this option that means you haven't actually received it but don't worry because Google is actually um, you know providing this uh, update in stages so very soon you will be receiving this if you're using it you know Nokia 8.1 or any other stock Android devices okay you should receive it now what are the features that we get now first thing it says that see a slideshow of your photos get commute info if you're using commute you know control media and more while your device is charging so these are the options that you get on the lock screen but main thing is that your device must be charging okay now photo frame of ambient display this should actually work as you know uh, that other custom UI is having already okay you can see the photos you know on your lock screen so that is also a really cool feature isn't it now you just have to turn this on and you can select photos okay from here okay you can select the photos whatever you like okay and then let me show you how does it work okay simply now if it is charging it will start like this okay now here you can see that you have five notifications okay now if I tap here okay because it is locked what happens it is locked so what you have to do unlock okay and then check this so this is one drawback I would say because um, you can see the notification but you cannot directly go to that notification and check what is it right let me show you again okay it is charging so notification I should be able to actually uh, you know directly go to that notification and check suppose what's up right so I should be able to check that message directly from here yeah that will actually cause some security issues that may be the reason that they have restricted this but you can see that yes there are certain notifications so this is one thing that uh, can be helpful suppose uh, if your phone is charging and if, if you give a glance and you know that okay someone has given some what's some messages or any notification you can check that right so this is one thing that you can check but yes the limitation is that you cannot actually directly check that message from the lock, lock screen okay now this is what is called that slideshow okay you can check this like this also okay yeah this is how it can be used okay automatically you can check okay and I think that uh, slideshow is very slow it doesn't change quite fast but you can actually slide it like this to see the photos okay so this is how it works and uh, now let me show you how does it look at night this is how it looks at night if you want to set any alarm simply tap here and say the sure. time when's the alarm for 7 a.m. yep so it's very simple okay after that if you want to return simply tap there and now you can also play music if you want to listen to any kind of night sounds night you know sleepy sounds then you can tap here so it will play this sound as well okay another thing is that you can uh, activate this option 
do not disturb so this profile will be activated so that is one thing that you can do with this quick you know access okay so this is how you can you know uh, play with these settings on this screen okay so i believe this is really um, you know good options because if you are charging your device and if you don't want to take the you know charge your cable out okay and without unlocking the device if you want to um, you know do these things so you can do it and after that you can also check your photos okay these are the photos google photos will be in the slides will be here so these are the things that you can do okay so that's a really cool feature isn't it so do let me know what do you think about this new feature now as i told you if it is locked then you cannot access directly the notifications right the messages cannot be checked directly but if it is not locked let me show if i unlock this and then if i go to this feature again uh, return to ambient mode okay if i tap here now if i check this now it will directly take me to the notifications so if you haven't logged the screen then it, it will actually take you to the notifications to the messages whatsoever whatever it is but yes if it is logged then you cannot actually directly access obviously as i showed you you can access the media you can you know play the you know music that can be done otherwise uh, you cannot actually you know access the notification or the messages so what do you think about this feature do let me know in the comment section and uh, do share your opinions and don't forget to subscribe to watch more videos on stock android devices so to the, till the next video guys cheers